What causes tree branches to fall or fail? Hey guys, my name is Mark Russell, 770 Arborist, and today I want to answer that question for you. We are July 19th-ish, no, I'm sorry, July 15th-ish. It's hot in Georgia, and today I want to talk to you about sudden branch failure, sudden branch failure syndrome, what is it? Sudden branch drop syndrome. Okay, so this week, last two weeks, I've gotten about eight to 10 calls from situations exactly like this. It's really funny because we're at a house just looking at a job to remove a couple branches or a couple trees. And I get out here and I look at this sweet gum branch and this sweet gum branch has failed. Look at all the way up at the top. Don't know if you can see that, but it's way up there. I'm gonna just pick it up and you can see way up at the top. So here's the question. Why do tree branches fail in the middle of the summer? And the answer is sudden tree or sudden branch drop syndrome. What is it? So here's the basics. And I don't know 100% of it, but I did sit through a class. And essentially the idea is, and you can kind of see, if you look in this, see this rounding here. Um, the way that this tree failed, it's delaminated here. And what you have is some delamination here, which is a separation. I don't know if you can tell that, but it's a separation of, essentially a separation of the rings as the tree grows and it's in the middle of the summer um, and it's really droughty or really wet. These rings in the tree, they are held together, laminated together as they grow. Under certain conditions in the hot months, low wind, it's, it's rarely a wind issue. Um, they'll just pop. It's really funny too, I got a good story, is when I uh, heard Dr. Kim Coder from UGA, um, he was giving a speech about this at the Georgia Arborist Association, and it was like a Thursday, two summers ago, and on my way home from that, um, from that, uh, convention or from that meeting, I'm driving by Ebenezer Baptist Church in, or in uh, Crabapple, Georgia, right when I drive by it. Maybe it's Episcopal Church. Anyway, point is, is right when I drive by it, I look over, oak branch snaps and falls on their arbor as I'm driving by it and no wind. And I was like, wow, I can't believe I just saw that. It was really cool because it's kind of a rare thing. So anyway, if you're wondering, hey, why did my tree just fail? A lot of times it's this sudden branch drop syndrome that uh, affects deciduous trees, which are today I got a call on a pecan. I got a call on a sweet gum. This is a sweet gum having issues. Uh, it affects oaks. You can look it up online uh, and, and see some different types of deciduous trees that it does affect. So anyway, hey, listen, if you have any tree questions, feel free to give me a call. My number is 770-ARBORIST. We work in the North Metro Atlanta area. We'd love to take care of you and answer the questions that you have about your trees. You guys take it easy. Bye-bye.